Have you ever wondered about the various religious ideas that make up our world's fabric? Well, you're in for a treat because in this video, I'll cover every major religion in the world in only 12 minutes. So aspiring, right? I know. But stick with me as I uncover all the religions on earth in an intriguing way. Let's start off with Christianity. With more than 2 billion adherents, Christianity is the most popular religion in the world. Beliefs about the conception, life, death, and resurrection of Jesus Christ are at the core of the Christian faith. Even though Christianity began with a tiny number of followers, many historians consider the global adoption and spread of the religion to be among the most fruitful spiritual endeavors in human history. As monotheistic people, Christians hold that there is only one God, and that he is the one who created the earth and the heavens. Three components make up this almighty Godhead, the Father, which is God himself, Jesus Christ, the Son, and last, but not least, the Holy Spirit. Christians believe that Jesus will make a second appearance on earth, which is referred to as the second coming. Important passages from the Holy Bible describe the teachings of Jesus, the lives and teachings of significant prophets and disciples, and provide guidelines for Christians on how to live. Christianity is symbolized by the cross, and its two main festivals are Easter, which honors Jesus' resurrection, and Christmas, which honors Jesus' birth. Next up is Islam. Islam, a religion founded by Muhammad in Arabia in the early 7th century. Islam is a word from Arabic that means surrender, more especially, submission to the will of the one true God, known in Arabic as Allah. Muslims, who follow Islam, consider the Prophet Muhammad to be the final and most ideal of God's messengers, along with Adam, Abraham, Moses, Jesus, and others. Islam is a completely monotheistic faith. The Quran, which records God's revelations to Muhammad, is considered a sacred text in Islam. The Sunnah, which recounts the sayings and deeds of the Prophet, is a significant source of Islamic theology and practice. The five pillars of Islam, which comprise faith in God and his Prophet along with the duties of prayer, almsgiving, fasting, and pilgrimage, represent the religious requirements of all Muslims. The Sharia, or its law, which encompasses the entire manner of life prescribed by God, is the central idea of Islam. Devout Muslims attend communal Friday prayers at the mosque, conducted by an imam, in addition to their five daily prayers. Barring physical infirmity or hardship, every believer is obligated to make a pilgrimage to the holiest city, Mecca, at least once in their lives. Ramadan is a month dedicated to fasting. It is always against the law to consume alcohol or pork, gamble, usury, commit fraud, slander, or create pictures. Apart from commemorating the breaking of the Ramadan fast on Eid al-Fitr, Muslims also mark Muhammad's birthday and his ascent into heaven. The Mecca pilgrimage season begins with Eid al-Adha. Hinduism With traditions and origins that stretch back more than 4,000 years, many academics claim that Hinduism is the oldest religion in the entire globe. Hinduism is currently the third most popular religion in the world, behind Islam and Christianity with over a billion adherents. India is home to over 94% of all Hindus worldwide. The religion's roots and history are hard to track down because it lacks a known founder. Hinduism is distinct from other religions in that it is a collection of many traditions and philosophies rather than a single one. Hindus respect multiple holy books, revere numerous gods and lesser deities, and celebrate a wide range of festivals and customs. Hinduism now has four main sects, Shaivism, Vaishnava, Shaktism, and Smarta. There are also several smaller sects that follow different religious traditions. Hindus prefer numerous holy books than a single sacred text. The Vedas, which are the principal religious writings, were written approximately 1500 BC written in Sanskrit. This collection of hymns and poetry includes revelations from ancient saints and sages. Buddhism Buddhism is a faith that was founded by Siddhartha Gautama, also known as the Buddha, more than 2,500 years ago in India. Buddhism is regarded by researchers as one of the major world religions, with an estimated 500 million to 1 billion followers. Several academics characterize Buddhism as a philosophy, 
or a moral code rather than an organized religion since it is a non-theistic faith without a god or deity to adore. Buddhism's core ideas and practices center on the idea of suffering and its causes. Though historically more common in East and Southeast Asia, Buddhism is becoming more and more popular in the West. Buddhism rejects the idea of a supreme entity or divinity. Rather, they concentrate on becoming enlightened, a calm and wise state of mind. It is said that followers have attained nirvana when they arrive at this spiritual level. Buddha's name translates to enlightened, and morality, meditation, and wisdom are the means by which enlightenment is reached. Buddhists think that meditation awakens truth, which is why they do it frequently. Buddhism does not have a single symbol, instead, a variety of pictures have developed to symbolize its ideas. These images include the lotus flower, the eight-spoke dharma wheel, the body tree, and the swastika, an ancient sign whose name translates to good fortune or well-being in Sanskrit. Judaism With a history spanning nearly 4,000 years, Judaism is one of the world's oldest religions and is regarded as the original Abrahamic faith, which also includes Islam and Christianity. Judaism is a monotheistic religion whose adherents hold that there is only one God, who made himself known to humanity via the prophets of old, such as Moses, Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, and Solomon. Apart from several other holy books, the Torah being the most significant, Jews also consider the Ten Commandments to be divine commandments that Moses was given. Approximately 14 million Jews live in the world today, and they worship in places called synagogues. The spiritual leaders of the Jewish people are known as rabbis, and they worship in hallowed spaces called synagogues. The emblem of Judaism is the six-point star of David. Confucianism Confucianism is an old Chinese philosophy and belief system that served as the basis for a large portion of Chinese culture. From 551 to 479 BCE, Confucius was a philosopher and teacher. His students recorded his teachings on morality, ethics, and good behavior in multiple works, the most significant of which being the Luanyu. Confucianism promotes human-centered ethics and ancestor worship as means of achieving inner serenity. Confucianism's cardinal precept is do unto others as you would have them do unto you. The question of whether Confucianism is a religion is up for dispute. Confucianism is best regarded as a moral code for living a moral life, however, Confucianism was also initially a resurgence of an earlier faith. Confucius is regarded more as a spirit than a god, and there are no Confucian gods. Nonetheless, there are Confucian temples, which serve as significant locations for civic and communal ceremonies. Confucianism is still debated today, with many people using the terms philosophy and religion interchangeably. Jainism India's ancient religion of Jainism holds that leading a life of renunciation and harmlessness is the path to happiness and freedom. Concern for the well-being of all living things and the cosmos as a whole is at the core of Jainism. Jains hold that all living things, including humans and plants, have souls. Since every one of these spirits is seen as having equal value, they ought to be treated with kindness and respect. Jains live a lifestyle that uses as little resources as possible and are devout vegetarians. The goal of ultimate liberation, according to Jains who believe in reincarnation, is to break free from the never-ending cycle of birth, death, and rebirth so that the immortal soul might live in joy for all eternity. They hold that neither gods nor other spiritual beings can aid people. Jains do not have priests. Monks and nuns are its professional religious members, they have austere lifestyles. Shinto Shinto, the way of the gods, is the indigenous faith of the Japanese people and as old as Japan itself. It remains Japan's major religion alongside Buddhism. Shinto does not possess holy texts such as the Bible or the Sutras, nor does it have a creator. Because Shinto is so ingrained in Japanese culture, propaganda and preaching are also uncommon. The term kami refers to Shinto gods. These are holy spirits that manifest as vital elements of existence, like wind, rain, mountains, forests, rivers, and fertility. After death, humans transform into kami, and their families honor them as ancestor kami. At certain shrines, the kami of exceptional persons are even housed. 
Amaterizu, the sun goddess, is regarded as the most significant kami in Shinto. Shinto has no absolutes, in contrast to many monotheistic religions. No one is flawless, and there is no such thing as absolute right or wrong. Taoism Ancient Chinese religion and philosophy known as Taoism, sometimes spelled Taoism, had an impact on national belief systems and folklore. The primary text of Taoism, the Tao Te Ching, was written by the philosopher Lao Tzu somewhere around 500 BCE. According to Taoism, both people and animals should coexist in harmony with the Tao, or universe. Taoists hold that after death, the soul of the body merges with the universe, a concept known as spiritual immortality. As the religion of the Tang dynasty, Taoism rose to prominence in the 9th century CE. It coexisted with Confucianism and Buddhism in the ensuing centuries. However, Taoism, Confucianism, and other religions were outlawed in 1949 under the communist takeover. Taoism's use in China decreased as a result of this. Though the number of Chinese Taoists has increased recently due to changes in China, many contemporary Taoists reside in Taiwan. Sikhism With over 25 million Sikhs globally, Sikhism is one of the largest religions in the world. The faith was founded by the Sikh gurus, also referred to as spiritual mentors or teachers. The first guru, Guru Nanak, was born in the Indian province of Punjab in the 15th century. Sikhs hold that everyone is equal and that all creatures are one. Being monotheistic, Sikhs believe in and worship just one God. According to Guru Nanak, respecting other people and God's creation, the earth, is a means of worshipping God. Guru Nanak was followed by nine other gurus who carried on his teachings throughout the world. The last guru was Guru Gobind Singh, who declared the Guru Granth Sahib, the holy book of the Sikhs, to be the everlasting guru who would lead them all eternity. The three main pillars of Sikhism were codified by Guru Nanak. These are 1. Van Chako, giving to others, lending a hand to those in need, and being involved in the community. 2. Kirat Ka, earning a living in an honest manner, without deception or exploitation, and always stating the truth. 3. Nam Japna, reciting the name of God in meditation to lead a morally upright and humble life. Sikhs view the fleeting distractions of the material world as an illusion. They fight against the temptations of the five qualities, ego, anger, greed, attachment, and lust, known as the five thieves, which rob people of their capacity to realize their oneness with God and creation.